Let's balance the chemical equation NH3 plus H2SO4. This is ammonia and this is sulfuric acid. We'll also look at the type of reaction and then the states. Let's start with the type of reaction. We have these two substances here. They're coming together to form one substance. That makes this a combination reaction. It's also called a synthesis reaction. To balance the equation, let's count the atoms up. We'll use a bit of a trick to make it easier. We have one nitrogen, three hydrogens, and then two hydrogens here. So we have five hydrogens. But this SO4, this is a polyatomic ion. We have it on both sides. It's called the sulfate ion. Since it's on both sides, we're just going to count it as one thing. That makes it a lot easier to balance. So we have one sulfate ion here in the reactants. On the product side, we have two times the one nitrogen. So that's two nitrogens, two times the four hydrogens. That gives us eight. So this two, it goes to everything here in the parentheses. And then we have just the one sulfate. So it makes it a little easier when we count the sulfate as one thing. We get the same answer either way. This is just quicker. Why don't we try to balance the nitrogens first to see what happens? We'll put a two here in front of the ammonia. One times two, that gives us two nitrogens. Those are balanced. Let's update our hydrogens now. Two times three is six plus the two here. That gives us eight. And we're done. This equation is balanced. If we were to write the states, we'd probably say that the ammonia would be aqueous, as would the sulfuric acid. And then the product here, this ammonium sulfate, that's soluble in water there. That's going to be aqueous as well. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for NH3 plus H2SO4, ammonia plus sulfuric acid. The type of reaction be a combination reaction, also called synthesis. Thanks for watching.